I thought I would spend hours furnishing this house. <laughs> Closer to 10 minutes than anything. Anyway, so here is the house as it is. Uh, how I set it up. I'll give you a quick tour here. I'm not, try not to make this too long. Uh, there is a huge lack of lights right now, but that's because I pretty much can't put any more lights in the house. And it's uh, 11.04 p.m., so that's kind of why. And stop in the name of love. Thank you. All right, so we got the bathroom here. I put the I put the uh, I, everything's kind of been condensed down pretty much. That's kind of what the theme is for uh, the differences, I guess, so to speak. Um, I will eventually change probably this up, but I can't afford it right now, so I'm not going to worry about it. Um, so yeah, I just kind of condensed two bathrooms into one, you know, put the sh the sonic shower here, put the big ass bathtub here. They'll have to share one toilet and one sink, which is just fine with me. Here's the, you know, the vanity love bed, you know, one like that. There are two beds. They're not going to have lights around them because they cost too much and they took up too much room in the house, quote unquote. I guess that's what that red bar kind of indicates. But anyway, um, I'm smart. I... And of course, I can't. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, so the problem is, is, I forgot to fucking put a chair here. And but the pro the thing is, is that I can't afford to do that. So let's see. What could I get rid of? I could get rid of probably a phone somewhere in the house. Uh, no, not really. <laughs> I didn't buy that many phones. I only bought like one. Um, I mean, I could get rid of something else, like a pool table or something like that, like the pool table or something, but I don't really want to do that. I want to try to avoid do that for, I want to try to avoid doing that as much as possible. However, I think I can actually, actually I will be able to get rid of one thing. Um, I'm going to get rid of this window here. Suck a dick. Yeah, yeah, don't need that there anyway. And of course it didn't change the actual room of the house. Because it's furniture! I'm a genius! Ha ha ha! I know what I'm doing. Oh, I actually can buy it? Oh, okay. For some reason that doesn't actually take up anything. I'll take it though. Alright, there we go. Now we can leave that alone. Uh, so yeah, the bath the bedroom and the bathroom were kind of condensed into one room for each. Uh, I put a lot of... I put, you know, most of the necessities, you know, are, I guess, necessities. Uh, most of the things that I wanted, I would like that. And, um, I kept the, I kept the bear carpet there, and I made, put the chess table in the middle to make it look like it's, like, the most intense thing ever. And also, if you looked at it from, if you look at it from a certain angle, kind of like that, it looks like the bear has, like, purple claws, I don't know. And it's kind of weird, but I was like, haha, I'll put it anyway, because I'm stupid like that. And treadmill, and of course got the fireplace, uh, which is kind of the main, which is the kind of the new thing of the game. I put a moose head here, just for the hell of it. <clears throat> Pull table, mostly for the hell of it. The pinball table, to mostly take up, kind of, you know, take up the space without actually, you know, without, you know, it being like, random, I guess. And then of course we got this, we got that, and then our bookshelf right here. Put a light on top of it, because, you know... It looked like I could use a light. Uh, I haven't really... I just put that canvas right there just because I didn't have anything else to put it up on. Put anything else up on there. Uh, and I need to actually move that phone. Move that phone! <laughs> Fucking... Actually, there we go. And I'll put it right here because that is the best place for it. And... kind of want to put something right there eventually, but I don't think that's going to happen. Okay, so let's go ahead... And take a look at our objectives. Get promoted to career level 10. Send kids to prep school. It is indeed prep school. With straight A's. Save $20,000 to buy a yacht for early retirement. So yes, this is... If that's not obvious, that is... That does mean that this game... That this is the last level of the game, so to speak. The last house of the game. Um, so let's see what they're doing here. Okay, he's going for that. And are they leaving? Hold on. Oh, okay. No, going swimming. <laughs> I was like, "Are they leaving?" It's like, "Oh, oh no!" Like Bruce and Family Guy. Oh no! And actually, you got to be really careful here because um, I think 
Yeah, that's why. That's why you want to be really careful, because if they drown, you're fucked. Well, I think. I'm pretty sure they can drown, though. I am fairly certain they can drown in this game. And that kind of freaks me out, because it looks like she's actually drowning. I was like... See, that freaks me out. I, I don't like it when they do that. That, that's freaky. That I don't want that happening. <laughs> I'll let them do their thing, but I really don't like seeing that. <laughs> especially some, especially considering I I've almost drowned five times, at least five times in my life. So, yeah, that freaks me the fuck out. Like, yeah, I would say drowning is definitely one of the worst ways to die by far. Even though it doesn't, even though it's not actually that bad. Anyway, let's see what's going on here. She, of course, decided to fucking work off of her own appetite and not fucking actually feed the family like she's supposed to. Um. Okay, that's whatever. This is the big problem: is that you get out. I might change his apparel eventually, but right now I'm just kind of. Meh. Did she really just leave? She did. Okay. Apparently, Sirius is the father of the house, and he decides that my rules are my rules, and you don't got don't get a goddamn say. And fuck him. There you go. So yes, this promotion thing is gonna actually take quite a while, actually. Uh, sending the kids off to prep school, though, shouldn't take very long, considering how easy it is anyway, just to, just how easy it is, generally speaking. And yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty dark, and of course every kid, everybody's like fucking, like, everybody's like buck wild up at four in the morning and don't give a fuck, in the don't give a fuck kind of mood, which is fine with me. Actually, I want him to work on logic. That would actually be a great thing to do, because not only is she doing that, but also... But also because of the fact that um, he has to he has to cover more ground than she does. And yes, we got to get a fourth friend in order to get our ten our yeah level ten promotion. I guess yeah. I was gonna say tenth promotion, but level ten is close enough. And also, I don't know why I put a wait yeah I don't know why I put a dishwasher and a sink there. Oh well, that logic. I'm gonna move the sink actually because I don't like the way it looks. There we go. That's a little bit better. I don't know. I just OCD sort of thing. I don't know. And also, that's what the pinball machine sounds like. It's really annoying actually, and it doesn't actually provide that much fun. So eventually I will get rid of it, but maybe. But just kind of depending on what happens. And she's about to soil herself. If you want to talk, you can wait for that. Because you think you're going to soil yourself. Yes, you are. You're going to have to run like force. Wait, he has to use the bathroom too? Oh my god. They both have to use the bathroom. <laughs> Jesus fucking Pete. Okay, so... uh, I might have to put a second toilet. I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I'll have to think about how I want to do that exactly. And I'll have her stand right here. There we go. Not right now. She has bathroom problems. And you are one of them. No. I was going to say, and you are one of them. Just be a dick, but no. Um, is there something... I don't know why, they, why she's so obsessed with wanting to talk to him. She has literally the same social he does right now. Okay. So. Let him do that. And. Yeah, and it's already 7 a.m. Okay. 
is fine with me. <laughs> now, see, she actually okay. But uh, I was gonna say that what the swimming in the pool actually does, as far as um, attributes are concerned, is that even though you can't see it, I think it works on body. I want to say. Like you can you can actually do a certain kind of swimming. You can do a certain command on swimming. It might be dive in, I don't know. Or swim, I don't know. It's one of those two. Yeah, it's swim or dive in and you can pretty much um work on your body points that way. Kind of interesting, I guess. And wow, everybody's on fucking point today. That's good. Except serious, of course, he's just like, Hey, I wanna log I wanna work on my logic, man. No, because on the off episodes, they wouldn't, they would, like, the kids would take the longest fucking route possible and also check that out. Serious in a fucking space, in a fucking astronaut suit right there. Like a boss. Like a fucking boss. Anyway. Um. I don't know. The kids would always take the really, like, the longest ways around the house and, like, never make, and would, like, miss, like, four, three or four days of school. Like, in about a six-day period or so. And it was, like, really annoying. Like, no, or, no, it wasn't. It was, like, three days in a six-day period. It was, like, every other day. And it was really, really annoying. And check out that lighting. Where, literally, the only light is actually outside. And the inside of the house just, like, sucks a dick. <laughs> it's just, it's, it's just dark. <laughs> anyway, um... What are we at right now? We are 11 minutes. Alright. And also gonna get a mechanical all the way up. Uh, actually I found out that, um... That, um... I, that, um, studying on mechanical books itself is actually... Uh, stu studying on mechanical books by itself actually is a faster method to... Um, building up your mechanical than actually, than building gnomes. Which makes sense, because you can get books on, like, really advanced mechanical stuff, where, where this, you're just making gnomes all day long, you know, so. That's something actually really important to know. Or, well, I wouldn't say actually really important, but something fairly trivial, I'll put it that way. But it's worth noting, only be, mostly because of the fact that, um, I decided to forget to put a door. Alright, cool. That was one of my plans earlier, and I had totally forgot about it. And I cannot put a door down at all. Fuck my face. I don't get that! When I sell a window, it does absolutely fucking nothing to this red- to the red bar on the side. And then when I decide to buy a door, it's like, oh, pfft, nope, you can't do that. Pfft, circle jerk. In your face. Um, well, whatever. Um... Uh, she'll just have to take the long way for now. Yeah, you can go paint. You can go follow her. Or... Okay, here we go. Nisa has been accepted into prep school. Boy, tuition sure is expensive these days. And fuck my face. It's actually funny because Nisa was actually the, the younger of the two, and she's going to prep school first. GG. So... We bid you adieu, Nisa. It was good. It was good to have raised you from birth into a strong, young, independent woman. Sad to see you go. And then Jennifer has been accepted into prep school. Boy, tuition is sure expensive these days. What do you mean you don't have enough for tuition? The school demands first installment on front. You're gonna pay. Uh-oh. He's gonna probably take something. What a dick! I wonder what he's gonna take, actually. Hold on. I wanna see. I wanna. Okay, let's get a view on both of them here, because, yeah, this is kind of a sad moment. <laughs> yeah, goodbye. Both kids made it into prep school! You unlocked Meet Major Domo! And that's a thing. Buy and mode, and buy mode. He's gonna take my TV, isn't he? What a dick face! Look at this motherfucker! He took my TV because I couldn't fucking afford tuition. I didn't actually expect to get them into fucking prep school so early though. That was my problem. That's my problem. Fuck you! 
Suck my fucking dick, you douchebag. Anyway. It's alright, though. We can do without TV. We got 800 sources of... Fuck you, no. Anyway, um... No, um... We got eight on. We got eight hundred other sources of fun anyway. So, uh, that's why. That's actually the main reason why I ma melded this into one bedroom because I knew it would either be really, really temporary, or it would be, or, you know, it would basically be pointless. So let's go ahead and see what we got left. We've got the promotion and the twenty thousand dollars for the yacht, or whatever. And unfortunately, I won't be able to make money to um with the painting so much, but I will be able to make money with the gnomes. I mean, make extra money to save up for or whatever. But yeah, um... Yeah, so, this is a pretty GG episode, I tell you. Uh, let's see. He's gonna go to bed, because he's had a hard day being an astronaut. He's had a hard day fucking planet Jupiter is, fu is screwing around with Uranus. So, um... Yeah, he had to take care... That, was, that must have been tough for him. Anyway, let's see... You are doing nothing exciting. And yeah, they're gonna go to sleep really hella early. But that's alright. Because I'll just make them sleep all night. Until like, probably 4 in the morning or something like that. Or most of the night, until about 4 or 5 in the morning. And... Um, I don't know what I'm really gonna do for the next episode yet. Um, I don't wanna really, really wanna just do daily activities or shit like that. I might do a couple of episodes where... Like, one or two episodes where Pamela gets promoted. Uh, well, no, that's, that would be kind of pointless, because now that the kids have retired, and... Or, if the kids have retired, wow. Yeah, okay. Um, no, now that the kids have been sent off to prep school, there's really not very much left to do in this game, besides, you know, the $20,000 and the, uh... Level 10 promotion. So, actually, what I could do right now is I could just say... Fuck it, two buck chuck it, suck a dick. And put my head inside of a bucket. And, yep, there we go. And now we won't have to worry about needing two bathrooms so much. Although, that wouldn't be a bad idea, actually. I'm gonna put this here, actually. That actually does not sound like a half bad idea. <laughs> it's putting a second bathroom anyway. But, I will leave that alone for now. And I think I will leave it off on, here on this note. And I will see you guys for when either Sirius gets promoted next, or when uh, Pamela gets promoted I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do just yet. Um, I think it'll be the next time... I think it'll be when Sirius gets promoted, because... I don't know. I don't really think Pamela's promotions like are really necessary to show off, because, I mean... If you just do the Daredevil lifestyle, you're going to find you're gonna find out what, she do, what all the fucking levels are anyway, so... Um, and I think... I want to try to get this, I want to try to finish up on this project and not really spend too many more episodes doing rather pointless things, you know, or whatever, or doing things that could have easily, easily been done off screen or whatever, so, yeah, so that'll be it for this episode, and I'll see you guys later.